To have 3D vision, you need determination, dedication, and discipline. Because if you have sight but no vision, that just means you're still blind. More than sight, you need insight. Today on In The Mix, let's have a courageous conversation about 3D vision. How to discover, develop, and deploy your greatness. Oh, I'm mic'd up. Join me and let's mix it up. Good, good people. I hope you're having a great day in a great way. Welcome to another edition, another episode of In The Mix. I'm yours truly, your host with the most, Dr. Eddie. And I hope you're ready. Come on, family. Hit the thumbs up button. Yeah. Hit the thumbs up button on this video. I don't want you to be a, a ghost follower at all. I want you to be a, a real, straight up, bona fide subscriber. Come on. Yeah. You're a subscriber and a partner. So yeah, hit the thumbs up button on this video, but also hit the subscribe button as well. Y'all know how we do it. Drop some light bulb emojis in the chat. We're getting ready to have a conversation of illumination, and we need to turn it all the way up. Let's brighten it up in here, up in here, up in here. It's going to be a 100 watt conversation. Going to keep it all the way 100. We're too lit to quit. Yes, we are. Why? Because we are the light of the world. Family, let's spotlight. Let's highlight. Yeah. Let's add light to our topic of today. Let's tackle the topic of 3D vision, how to discover, develop, and deploy your greatness. Everybody has greatness within them. But here's what I realize. Generally, that's where it remains. I want you to think about what I just said. Everybody has greatness within them, but generally, that's where it remains, just within them. I have to push out my greatness. I have to make sure that I give life to the greatness that's all on, the, on the inside of me. I got to have the temerity. I got to have the tenacity. I have to have the aspect of a visionary to be able to do that. I have to be an envisioner and a person with vision is going to see more and before. What I love is what the late great Dr. Miles Monroe suggested and conveyed. He said, vision is purpose in pictures. Oh, I like that. Let me say that twice because it's also nice. Vision is purpose in pictures. When, I, when I'm closing my eyes, what do I see? When my eyes open, what do I see? I got to see it before I see it so that I can seize it. Come on, family, type 3D vision, 3D vision, three-dimensional. It's spiritual, it's practical. Yes, it is. And family, you know whenever I got this on, you know whenever I have my apparel on, it's on. We got class tonight, right after this session, I would that you would make sure that you make your way. If you go ahead and get registered right now, you can be a part of our amazing class. It's going to be illuminated, it's going to be empowering. We're going to take it to another level than beyond just right here. Go to TheEaglesAcademy.com, TheEaglesAcademy.com, TheEaglesAcademy.com. The link is in the chat. The link is in the description of this video. You can register for just $24.99. Yeah, special rate for just $24.99 that you can go ahead and get registered for. Go right now. TheEaglesAcademy.com. Tap the Join Now button. Fill out the form. Be transformed. Do you know this? Did you know this? That only 5% of people write down their goals. I want you to really think this. I want you to really wrap your mind around that. 
Are you one of those 5%? Only 5% of the people on this planet write down their goals. Here's another part of that statistical narrative. Of the 5% that do, of the 5% that do write down their goals, 95% of the time they accomplish their goals. Zig Ziglar put it this way. He said, what you get by achieving your goals is not as important as what you become <laughs> by achieving your goals. What you get by achieving your vision is not as important as what you become by achieving your vision. In essence, goals are people. And I need you to understand this. The goal is not the destination. The goal is a person. The goal is a future part of you. It is you moving it into a particular place of this is what I must do. This is who I must become in order to achieve what it is that I desire to have. Are you hearing me? Are you following me? Are you tracking with me, family? Because every vision, every goal is a future person. And I need you to hear me. In order to reach that vision, in order to reach that goal, this is what it is. You first have to become it. <laughs> Lord, bless me with it. Lord, give it to me. Lord, help me to get it. Lord, help me to apprehend. And God is saying, are you willing to become what it is that you desire to have? You want a healthy marriage. Are you willing to become sex successfully single? Well, you want a healthy marriage, but are you willing to be successfully single? Are you willing to prepare? You want financial freedom, but are you a good steward of your finances? You want promotion, and there is no promotion without preparation. Who am I talking to? I hope it's you. There is no promotion without preparation. I got to become what it is that I desire to have, what it is that I desire to reach, what it is that I desire to fulfill. And I can't despise the day of small beginnings. No dream is unreachable. No goal is unattainable. No vision is unachievable. Many times you've been told no, but you got to realize this. No is new opportunity. I have to move into a place of determination, of dedication and of discipline. I got to be determined. Family, just type determine. Determination says, listen, I've made a decision. Yeah, because indecision is also a decision, too. Determination says this. This is the act of defending. This is the act of deciding, rather. Definitively and firmly that this is what I'm going to do. Yes, yes, it is. This act of making a declaration and a decree that this is what I'm going to do by any means necessary. Determination is that act of deciding. It is that act of defining. Firmly, completely, this is what I'm going to do. And matter of fact, I'm going to make sure that it happens. Whether I feel like doing it or whether I don't, that's what, that's what it is I'm determined. I'm determined to make it happen. I'm not going to be indecisive about it. Come on, family, type dedication, type dedication, type dedication. Told you determination, type dedication. Dedication. We're having a super conversation. Drop a super chat, drop a super sticker. The chat is going, the chat is growing. I would that you would go ahead and secure a badge and you getting a badge is saying, listen, I'm not just in the mix, but I'm a member of in the mix. I'm a partner. And so I would that you would partner with me. And your support helps our channel to grow, our channel for change, our channel that creates change, our channel that breaks chains, helps us to broaden our broadcast. It helps us to secure 
You're helping us to secure the type of funding so that we can get the type of equipment that we need to make our show bigger, better, and brighter. My gift and my gift to you is to now allow you to be a member and in the mix member to where now you're part of our coaches, our Connor's Corner content. Where I'm doing some coaching, I'm doing some teaching, I'm doing some training. I'm sharing some insight, a lot of behind the scenes footage that you won't see on my social media, much less you won't see it on my YouTube page. Only in our membership area. Membership has its privileges. Links in the chat, links in the description of this video for how to go ahead and secure a badge and tap the join button to go ahead and get it. We're talking, we're talking, we're talking about 3D vision. 3D vision is so key, it's so important, it's so necessary. How to discover, develop, and deploy your greatness. For you to do that, you're going to need determination, as I mentioned. You're also going to need dedication. Your dedication is saying this, I am committed to this particular task. I am committed to this particular purpose. I am committed to making sure that I am going and I'm growing to the next level. I am making this happen by any means necessary. That is what that commitment is. That is what it is about what it is that I am committed to do. Mm -hmm. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. I am committed to this particular task. I am committed to this particular purpose. Yeah, I'm not going to deviate from it. This is what it is that I have been given. This is what it is that God has instructed me to do. And I'm going to do it by any means necessary. That, that's that type of stick to itiveness. That's that type of committed wherewithal mindset that you have to possess. I got to be committed to the commitment. Hmm. Can, can you be committed to the commitment to be to be dedicated? That dedication speaks to the level of the commitment to that particular task, to that particular purpose. Family, we're talking about 3D vision. We're talking about 3D vision. We really are. Here's another aspect of 3D vision. What we're talking about discovering, developing, deploying your greatness. Here's another word that a lot of times we don't really like. <laughs> really don't. But here it is. Family, just type discipline. Come on, type discipline. Ooh, we don't like discipline. Because you know why we don't really like discipline? Because discipline moves us into a place of doing something that it is that we don't feel like doing. You know you want butterfingers instead of blueberries? I do. Since y'all not going to testify, I'm going to testify for you. Yeah, I prefer Skittles over strawberries and... and yeah, yeah, I do. I prefer Skittles and Starbursts over strawberries. I prefer chips over carrots, but you can't spell chips without hips. <laughs> can't, can't do it. Come on, you spell it out. I bet you bottom dollar. Discipline, family. Because I understand that there's two types of pain in life. The pain of discipline and the pain of consequence. The pain of consequence moves you into this particular place. And I know I've been there. Lord have mercy. Shoulda, coulda, woulda. I wish I would have. Procrastinating. And procrastination is the arrogant belief that God is going to give you another opportunity to do what he told you to do today. Let me say that come what may. Procrastination is the arrogant belief that God is going to give you another opportunity to do what he told you to do today. That's the pride. I got to put the pride and the ego aside. Because here it is. Pride and ego is not going to step aside. You have to put it aside. You got to put it asunder. Discipline moves me into that particular aspect. It's two types of pain in life, y'all. Pain of discipline or the pain of consequence. Right? The pain of consequence is, man, I'm only going to do what I feel like doing. If I don't feel like doing it, it's not going to get done. Discipline says the greatest blessing is doing what you don't feel like doing. 
family. I've never, I've never felt like doing and writing every book that I've written. Come on. I've never felt like getting on in the mix every day. Come on. But here's the thing. I, I know it's bigger than me. Impacting you is bigger than me. So guess what? I show up. And when you show up, you ought to show out. When you show up, you ought to shine. When you show up, it ought to be a testament to say, listen, I'm determined. Yeah, I'm, t- I'm determined to do what I need to do. I'm dedicated and I'm disciplined because discipline is about self-control. Discipline, here it is, is about direction and order. And hear me, the opposite of order is chaos. And if we're really going to be honest, for many of us, you're out of order. You're out of order. You're out of order in how you talk to people. You're out of order in how you treat yourself. You're out of order with with your level of emotional intelligence. You're out of order with your attitude. You're out of order because you only do what you feel like doing. You're out of order because here's the thing. You want to give orders. But you can't take any. Hello, somebody. Yeah, you want to give orders to everybody else, but you don't want to take any orders. You want to make demands, but are you in demand? Are you making a demand on your gift and on your purpose? Are you making a demand on it? To say, listen, I, yeah, I'm making a demand on my determination. I'm making a demand on my dedication. I'm making a demand on my discipline. Why? Because if it's to be, it's up to me. Come on, family, type 3D. If it's to be, it's up to me. I'm giving you a vitamin B3 shot. I'm giving you your vitamin B3 in the midst of 3D conversation. Bigger, better, brighter. Yeah, bigger, better, brighter. Build back better. Breakthrough, believe Breathe. 3D. Determination, dedication, discipline. Discover, develop, deploy. I didn't even get to that yet, family. Come on. Come on, family. We got we got to turn up the temperature on this thing. We got to turn all the way up. Come on, family. We're having a super conversation. Drop a super chat. Drop a super sticker. Come on. Yeah. You don't, you don't even have to wait for the offering decree. You can send a cash app right now. Dollar sign access identity. PayPal. Zell. Eddie Connor JR. Gmail. Super chat. Super sticker. In the midst of the super conversation. Family, you know, whenever I have my apparel on, it's on. And, and hear me, we getting ready to soar even higher tonight. I love Wednesday nights. We, we getting ready to soar even higher. So I want you to soar with us. I want to take you to a place within yourself that you can't go by yourself. You know that there's something greater calling you. You know, you got to have that commitment to excellence. We want to show you how to do that. You know, you're in need of accountability partners. You know, you need to write down those particular goals. You need to, you know, you need to have an action plan for those particular goals. You know, you need strategy, structure, solutions, and systems to take your vision to another dimension. Let me show you how to increase your ideas, your impact, and your influence. My goal is to help you reach yours. And I've orchestrated and created my community, which is designed to do just that. Go right now to theeaglesacademy.com, theeaglesacademy.com, theeaglesacademy.com. When you get there, tap the Join Now button, fill out the form. I guarantee you're going to be transformed. Here it is for just $24.99. Worth every dime. It's It's worth more than that, honestly. But I made it affordable. I want you to sow into yourself. I want you to invest in yourself as well. Come on, family. Hit the thumbs up button. Hit the thumbs up button on this video. Hit the subscribe button. Again, those who go ahead and join our Eagles community, you'll be able to be in our session tonight. That's right. We're talking about that 3D vision, family. Family, just type excellence. 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 
That here's what I realize: there is something good about an ex. <laughs> hey, don't don't throw nothing at my screen now, because you just had a flashback. You got triggered. You got you got triggered off of that. Yeah, Here, here's the thing. For it to be an example, you got to have X. For you to be in your exact moment, in your exact season, you got to have X. For you to walk in a place of excellence, it begins with EX. For, for here it is, for you to exit out of where it is that you've been into your next season. For you to have an exodus moment. Ooh. Come on, family, just type, this is my exodus. For you to have your exodus moment, it's going to take an X. Every X ain't bad. Sometimes the X is a setup for what's next. I don't, I don't, somebody must be praying for my energy. I don't know what's happening to me, but I feel, I feel my help coming on now and it's real strong. <laughs> yeah, that, that'll preach as they say. I got to move to another dimension and it begins with a mental intention. Breaking news, breaking news, breaking up the fallow ground right here. <laughs> got a special message in the midst of this special message because it surely is one. And what you stick and stay more is on the uh, more is on the way, family. Yeah. On the other side of this break, there is more breakthrough after these messages. I'll be right back. Our schools are underfunded, teachers are underpaid, and our children are undereducated. Our classrooms, culture, curriculum, and communities are in crisis like never before. Education is the key, but the lock is broken. So how do we fix it? I'm so glad that you asked. I'm giving you strategies in my new book. It's my 17th book, by the way, called Strategies for Successful Schools. How to Develop a Diverse Classroom of Learners Who Read, Lead, and Succeed. There's a book that's available right now for our educational leaders. It's a must read for school board members, parents, community advocates, transformative teachers. And yes, for those of you who desire to see our children lead and succeed. But not only that, so many of our young people are struggling with their academics, their mental well-being, limiting beliefs, procrastination, interpersonal trauma, and just feeling like they're hopeless. But what if there was a go to guide to empower you to be a champion and our children to be a champion and empower them to overcome challenges? Here's the good news. I've got another book for you. It's my 18th one. Learners are leaders. Strategies and solutions for student success. It's got a 31 day journal in there. It's got affirmations, really a lot of valuable life lessons, ways to set smart goals for success, improve your mental well-being, foster academic success. So much more that is in store when you get not just one, but both of these books. They're both available right now on Amazon. Yeah, go get it right now. But also, you can get signed copies that are available at theeaglesacademy.com forward slash books. Don't just get them for you, but also get them for someone else, too. Yes, yes, y'all. And we don't stop. Come on, family. I need you to heed to these resources that you've heard. Mm hmm. <gasps> Let's get back to the word. Family, we're talking about 3D vision. Yeah, how to, de how to discover, develop, and deploy your greatness. We got to do that. We got to do that. We, we, we have to develop ourselves in all these particular areas. We can't just be myopic. We just can't be linear. We have to be panoramic. A lot of us are gifted in certain areas that we also need to grow in. And we think just because we're gifted in one particular area that we don't need to grow in any other area. Well, that's a lie. Yeah, that's a lot. And that's a lot. Just because you can preach don't mean you can complain. Just because you can preach doesn't mean you can plan. Just because you're prophetic doesn't mean you have a strategy to profit. Yeah, I hope you don't flow on the pathetic. <laughs> you flow on the prophetic. Come on, just because you're anointed doesn't mean you know how to administrate. 
just because you have a title and can teach doesn't mean you know how to train leaders. It's tight, but it's going to be all right. Because what is it to have a title, but you don't have a function? Leadership goes beyond my title. Leadership is about my particular purpose. And here's what I have to do. I can never do any of those things. I can't plan. I can't profit. I can't administrate. And I can't train if I don't have 3D vision. If I'm not three-dimensional in my thinking. To where I'm able to perceive my surroundings, to where I'm able to, to look at it and judge the distance, to, be, to, to where I'm able to be able to, to where I'm able to interact in my particular environment. I got to be a three dimensional thinker so that I can be a three dimensional leader. What I need to do. Yeah, I told you determination, dedication, discipline is, in key, is key, is important. But if we really want to turn it up to another degree, I have to discover if we're going to turn it up to another degree. I have to make a discovery. What I like about in the mix in the mix is the discovery channel. <laughs> it show is family. Mm hmm. Yeah. I love it here. I hope you do too. Come on, family. Type I love it here if you love it here. Come on, type I love it here if you love it here. This, this is the Discovery Channel because why? I'm, I'm empowering you. Why do I show up every single time? Why do I show up Monday through Friday? Because I want you to discover another element of who it is that you are. I, I want to peel back another layer that you didn't maybe know, maybe were aware to. Or aware of rather. You didn't have any awareness about. I, I want to show you these particular elements and layers that you need to consider to be a conqueror and not just a conqueror, but more than conqueror. And so here's what I got to do. I got to discover. I have to make a, a particular self discovery. Because a lot of us are asking, how do I make more money? And if you're asking, how do I make more money? That's the wrong question. You should be asking, how do I find the people that need me? How do I show up? How do I serve? And when I show up, do I shine? Do I move people into a particular place to where I'm giving value? I got to I got to add value. All of us are valuable, but all of us don't add value. Yeah, yeah let me say that again. All of us are valuable, but all of us don't add value. Come on, family, type that. Add value. Add value on the job. Add value to your coworkers. Add value to your employees. Add value as an employer. Add value in your church. Add value in your community center. Add value in your sorority and your fraternity. Add value. Add value on the podcast. Add value when you're writing your books. You have to add value. People want to go where the value is. Yeah, where the money reside, where the money reside. But where does the value provide? That's the deeper question. So I have to make a self-discovery. Everyone under the sound of my voice, listen, you are a red box and a gold bow. You are a gift to the world. Tragedy is to be gifted, but to never open your package. Much less to use what is in your package. I have to tap into the giftedness of what it is that God has given me. And here it is with your discovery comes a uniqueness to you. I don't care if you're a fraternal twin, I don't care if you're an identical twin. There's a uniqueness to you. You are not the same as everybody else. Stop trying to fit in when you were born to stand out and be outstanding. But here's what you have to do. You have to keep standing on your principles, standing on your morals, standing on your beliefs, standing on your values. Making that self-discovery. Too many times we're looking out, but are you looking within? Are you discovering what is it that I'm really good at? 
What are the challenges that I'm facing? What are the what is the untapped potential? What are the untapped gifts that I still have yet to discover? Who am I? I need you to ask these particular questions. Who am I? What makes me me? What am I good at? What are my gifts? What are my talents? What am I passionate about? Who am I called to serve? Where am I going? Who do I want coming with me? Do you see? Oh, say, can you see? Do you, do you understand the words that, I'm com- that are coming out of my mouth? In the words of Chris Tucker. Movie Rush Hour, but let me not rush through this hour. Let me hurry up and take my time. Are you understanding what I'm saying? I have to make that internal discovery. Because if not, I will always try, I will always be a carbon copy. If I don't make a personal, distinct, and unique discovery, I will always live as a carbon copy. When God has moved you to walk into a place of identity, identity as a portal of opportunity. Family, come on, type discover, type discover. Talking about that 3D vision that you have to possess. Because if you have sight but no vision, you're still blind. And more than sight, we need insight. We really do. Yeah, I got to have that determination, got to have that dedication, got to have that discipline. But I also need some discovery. I also need, secondly, well, maybe that's, you know, we got determination, dedication, discipline, so that's three. Discovery, that's four. Yeah, five. Five, I like five. That's favor. Favor helps you, here it is, to develop. Come on, family, type that. Develop. Type develop. Develop. Got to move a place into a place of development. Socrates said this. Socrates said, He, or even she, who wants to change the world must first change themselves. He or she who wants to change the world must first change themselves. What what does he mean by that? If you want to change the world, it begins by changing your world. It begins by transforming your world. You have to develop your skills. You have to give your mind an assignment each and every single day to elevate, to innovate, to create. To say, listen, when I'm on the job, what can I do to add value? Not what can I do to quiet quit? Not what can I do to say, you know, I'm ready to leave already when I just arrived. It is me being able to think like an entrepreneur, being able to think like an entrepreneur, developing the mindset of an entrepreneur while being an entrepreneur. Because an entrepreneur is an innovator. I need to be thinking about how it is can I innovate this particular industry? How can I develop? How can I innovate? How can I create? How can I move the needle forward? How can I add value? Because most people are not thinking like that. Most people are listening to a station as if it was on the radio, WIIFM. Yeah, I don't know if you ever been tuning WIIFM. Listen, we got WJLB here in Detroit. FM 98, WJLB. Yeah, we got KISS FM. We got Hot 107. We got Mix 92.3. We got the Mix 2 right here. Don't you agree? Talk to me. Come on, family. Just type in the mix. I ain't never had you type that before, but (laughs) I'm feeling it right now. Come on, family. Just type in the mix. In the mix. Family, you got all them stations. But here it is. Many of us are programmed to our own mental frequency and our own internal station. Here it is. Your frequency is whatever you think about frequently. Are you hearing me? Your frequency is dictated by whatever you think about frequently. And many of us are only on the frequency of WIIFM. What's in it for me? Y'all better talk to me. Yeah, WIIFM. 
you you the DJ. You the host with the most. You're the program director. Mm Mm-hmm. Because you programmed your mind in a place of what's in it for me. Forget about you. It's about me. Lil Wayne said, all about I and give the rest of the vowels back. You have to shift from I to us, from me to we. That's how it's got to be. That moves you into a place of moving from, moves you into a place of shifting from being selfish to being selfless. Greater is he that's within me than he that's in the world. It's not that you usurp and that anybody else is inferior to your superiority. No, 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 no. You move into a particular place of what is it that I can do to discover my gifts, to develop my gifts. Because I cannot develop people if I don't develop me. And I can never develop people any bigger than I develop myself. I can never develop people any more than I develop myself. I got to move in that particular place of discovery, discovery, development. And last but not least, come on, family, type deploy. Type deploy. Discovery, what am I called to do? Who am I called to serve? What are the areas of the, in many cases, the mountains of what it is that I am supposed to maximize? Those seven areas within the mountain place marketplace, the mountaintop market space, the mountaintop marketplace. Is it in the religious sector? Is it in the wellness sector? Is it in the education sector? Is it in the social sector? Is it in arts and entertainment and media? Is it in government or business? What are the areas that you have been called to influence? And here it is. Sometimes it's a confluence. It is a mixture of things. It may not necessarily be one dimensional because you're not one dimensional. You're multidimensional. And so you're multi-gifted. You're multi-talented. But, but hear me. You can't see what you can't see if you don't have 3D vision. You can't know what you don't know if you don't discover, if you don't develop. And like I also said, if you don't deploy. Where am I called to serve? Who am I called to serve for the discovery? Development, I need to be intentional about it. And then also deploying. Deploying mean I need to identify, address certain snipers in my life, whether it be emotional snipers, whether it be vision snipers, whether it be emotional squatters, whether it be a scarcity mindset. I need to identify these things and then I also need to deploy myself as if I am a military cadet cadet is if I am a soldier because I am a soldier in the army of the Lord and I need to fight against what's fighting me why because there's a battlefield of the mind I got to fight against what's fighting me if you don't handle it it's gonna handle you weapons of my warfare are not carnal but they are mighty through God to the pulling down of strongholds spiritual wickedness In high places. What is the wickedness that has been perpetuated against your mind? What are the emotional snipers that have been perpetuated against your heart, your mind, your soul, and your spirit? How will you identify it? How will you address it? How will you identify all of the personal proclivities that are seeking to undermine you? Come on, it's, t- it's time to, after you discovered it, after you developed it, it's time to deploy yourself into your greatness. A lot of us have a ready, ready, aim, 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 but you never shoot. Oh, shoot. 
You're ready. You're aiming. Yep, aim, aim. But you don't, you, you don't shoot. You don't go for it. You don't shoot for the goal. You don't shoot your shot. You got all the artillery in the world. You have all the power internally in the world. But you never go for it. You never do something with it. And you just sit back and repose. I suppose in isolation. You've done the work to discover. You've done the work to develop. But you're not deploying yourself. You're not going for it. You're stuck and you're stagnant and you're stifled and you're stymied. And here's what you're doing. You are wasting time. You have all the requisite skills. You have all the requisite talent and the resources. But what are you doing with it? Come on, family. Talk to me. Come on, family. If you haven't typed it, type discover. Type de develop. Type deploy. Type go for it. Go for it. Do something with it. You have been gifted for greatness. Somebody's waiting for you to become who you are so they can become who they're supposed to be. How much longer will you make them wait? Family type, no delays. No delays. No delays. It's time to take flight. It really is. It's time to go where you've never gone before, to do what you've never done before. It's time to soar into more. Come on, family, type soar. Type soar. It's time to soar into more. It's time for you to mount up on wings as an eagle. You're going to run and you're not going to be weary. You're going to walk and you're not going to faint. I got, I got that 3D vision. That's, that's the beauty of an eagle's vision. An eagle can see more and before. An eagle, a regal eagle, can see as far as two miles of a distance. 5,280 feet in a mile. Times that by two. Yeah, over 10,000 feet. Plus, that the bird can see. I'm believing right now that God is increasing your vision like an eagle. He's giving you eagle eye vision. You're going to see ahead. You're going to see further. You're going to see farther. God is expanding and stretching the elasticity of your thinking and of your vision. You're not just going to see linear. You're going to see panoramic. You're going to see from different angles. And every single time that you look from a different angle, here it is. There's another blessing coming. Everywhere, every time you turn around, he's making a way. Every blessing that you see that's to the left, it's to the right. It's coming from all directions. It's coming from all angles. God is doing it. God is improving it. God is increasing. Come on, family, type increase. Type increase. Type increase. Type increase. Come on, you owe it to you to join our Eagles community tonight. Increase your ideas, increase your impact, increase your influence. Go right now to the EaglesAcademy.com. The link is in the chat. The link is in the description of this video. It's time for you to adopt 3D vision, determination, dedication, discipline. Time for you to discover, time for you to develop, time for you to deploy your greatness. Go right now to TheEaglesAcademy.com. When you get there, tap the Join Now button, fill out the form, be transformed. It's your season of increase. It's your season of activation. It's your season of development. It's your season of discovery. It's your season of development. It's your season of deploying yourself into your greatness. It's your season to walk in a place of determination. It's your season of dedication. It's your season of intense discipline. With intentionality. No indecision. No indecisiveness. Because a double-minded man or woman is unstable in all of their ways. And hear me, when, you're, when your ways please the Lord, he maketh even your enemies to be at peace with you. I speak peace over your life. I speak increase over your, your goals and your soul and your personal development. I, see, I speak maturational development over you. I speak expansion. I speak favor. I speak divine assignments. 
or speak being in alignment with your divine assignment. I speak maximum vision. I speak implementation. I speak the requisite resources and the, the budgetary needs and the concerns of what it is that you have to be financially feasible for it to be fixed for men to sow into you for women to sow into you i speak greater favor over the vision over the plan over the blueprint over the development over the church over the community center over the vision because this is your season of provision come on family i want you to sow into this word that you've heard I, if you believe it i want you to sow into it this, this is your season of provision as you're sowing your seed, I want you to name your seed. Come on, family. You know how we do. We've been having a super conversation. Drop a super chat. Drop a super sticker. Yes, we have. Cash app, dollar sign access identity, PayPal, Zelle, Eddie Connor, JR, Gmail. As you're sowing your seed, I want you to name your seed. Maybe you're naming your seed excellence. Maybe you're naming your seed 3D. Maybe you're naming your seed 3D vision. Maybe you're naming your seed provision. Maybe you're naming your seed discover. Maybe you're naming your seed develop or deploy or determination or dedication or discipline. I don't know what you're naming your seed, but I want to stand in agreement with you that God does exceedingly abundantly above all that he can ask, that you can ask or think. That he blows your mind. That he blesses you in such a crazy way. In such a ridiculous way that he makes you laugh. Yeah, <laughs> I can't believe God did it again. <laughs> it didn't look like this thing was going to turn around, but boy, the God that I serve is able. Yeah, to do anything but fail. And I speak over your life in this season, you're going to do anything but fail. You're not going to fail. You're going to prevail. Let me talk to you. Let me talk to you. That's for somebody. You will not fail. You will prevail. Let me speak to every queen. God is within her. She will not fail. Come on, king. God is within you. You will not fail. You will prevail. You're going to prevail. You're going to live to see it happen. And I guarantee you it's going to be big. Come on, family, sow into this word. This sow where you sow, sow where you grow. This is where you sow. This is where you sow. This is where you grow. And this ought to be where you sow. Not as a debt that you owe, it is a seed that you sow. You're going to live to see it happen. And it's going to be big. Cash App, Dow Sign, Access Identity, PayPal, Zell, Eddie Connor, JR at Gmail. I'm excited for what God for what God is going to do in and through you. If you're not a part of our Eagles community, join us tonight. Join us even now so that you can be a part of our session right after this session has concluded. You owe it to you to be in a community that expands your growth. How do we do that? I'm coaching, I'm teaching, I'm training, and our live session is going to be a live session tonight. Live in color where you're interacting with me in real time, family. Diagrams, strategy, structure, solutions, and systems to take your vision to another dimension. I'm giving you that. I'm doing that. You also have Eagle's Nest Reflections after each and every single session. To where now you are metacognitive. You think about what you think about. You're able to reflect, reset your mind. And then you also get feedback from me about the Eagle's Nest Reflection, quote-unquote, homework that you complete. You'll be a part of our exclusive Facebook group, filled with motivation, gearing you into a particular place of greater determination. You also are able to network with our accountability partners. You're able to network with other leaders in industries like you and from different industries that you may not necessarily be in. Your network determines your net worth. Then you also have 24-7, 366 access to any and all sessions, past and present. You owe it to you to get the insight, the inspiration, to be impacted, and to increase your influence. 
sessions on business, sessions on faith, sessions on spiritual development, sessions on financial freedom, sessions for progression, on relationships, on vision, on purpose, on branding, on marketing, on doing marketing in the marketplace. We have so much more in store. I want you to join us. Go right now to the EaglesAcademy.com. The EaglesAcademy.com. When you get there, tap the Join Now button, fill out the form, be transformed. I can't wait to see your face in our digital space tonight. It's going to be amazing. Family, hit the thumbs up button on this video. Hit the thumbs up button on this video. Hit the subscribe button as well. I don't want you to be a ghost follower. Family, was this session empowering? Was it impactful to you? Yeah, I want you to partner with me and my Eagles Academy. But I also want you to be a partner as well of In The Mix. It's one thing to watch In The Mix. another thing to actually be a member of In The Mix. And not only are you a member, not only are you a subscriber, but you are also a partner. So I want you to partner with me. All you have to do is just secure a badge. That's a support. Helps us to broaden this broadcast, expand our reach, purchase necessary equipment that caused me to amplify my voice and then also stream this message into the eyes and the ears of men and women, boys and girls who not, may not necessarily know about this show and you help us grow simply by becoming a member. Membership as low as $9.99. You can go ahead and get that and get access. My gift to you is where I give you access to our membership portal, our membership area. We got videos where I've shown you a lot of behind the scenes footage, coverage and information of what I don't share everywhere, where I share no place other than the membership portal of YouTube. You owe it to you. Go ahead. Check it out. Link is in the chat. Link is in the description. Tap the join now. Tap the join button on this video as well. Family, I appreciate you tuning in in the mix is out of time but family y'all know i am not out of truth yeah so i want to thank you for rocking with me i want to thank you for rolling with me i want to thank you for rocking with me i thank you for riding with me i really want to thank you for rolling with me yeah because that's just how we roll and we roll together each and every single weekday monday through friday for in the mix Mm-hmm. right here on the youtube side But of course, we're also on the social media side. Shout out to all of our viewers on the social media side, our sister who are watching our sister satellite stations on social media. Give you a sincere salute. And I just got a question for you. Are you my friend? Are we locked in? Then step this way. Step that way. Yeah, step this way. Step that way. What way is this? What way is that? You can get this and that simply by following me right now today. On Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, Twitter, TikTok, we don't stop at Eddie Connor Jr. Come on, family, put some respect on my name. E D D I E C O N N O R J R. Go ahead, connect with me there. If I can help you, if I can serve you in any way, don't hesitate, family. Please reach out to me. If you're looking for a dynamic speaker, now why would you look any further? Come on, you know me. I'm the man for the job. Invite me to speak at your church, your conference, your community center. Your school, your graduation, your college, your session. Let's make some progression, and we can do that simply by emailing me. Info at eddieconnor.com. Info at eddieconnor.com. It would be an honor for me to empower you. Sure, truly, Dr. Eddie, your main man, 100 grand, your brother, and I mean that, from another mother. Family has been fun, but you know, brother, got to run. So I want you to know it's been a privilege and a pleasure. A treat and a treasure, a joy. Yes, it has been beyond measure. But I want you, I'm talking to you, yes, you, to keep the faith. Remember to keep the faith and believe it's going to be bigger, better, a whole lot brighter. Peace. And yeah, a whole lot of love too. Keep soaring higher. Family, there is power in partnership, and we are better together, which is why I am on a mandated mission. To activate 30, yes, 30 new action takers who are ready to soar beyond their limits. I'm ready to develop and deploy you into your gifts and your greatness. Now, are you ready? Well, get activated. 
by joining the Eagles Academy, where we cultivate your gifts and your talents to become the greatest version of yourself. And we do this through weekly mastermind sessions where you receive strategies for exponential growth with self-paced Eagles Nest reflections that include personalized feedback to transform you, to renew your mindset, to empower you to take action and actualize your purpose. Are you an action taker? If so, today I ask you, are you ready to answer the call? Well, great. Then visit theeaglesacademy.com and become a member. For only $24.99, you will unlock unlimited knowledge and resources that will launch you and catapult you into the greatest version of yourself. I invite you to the winner's circle. On your mark, get set, go right now to theeaglesacademy.com and seize this moment.